What's up guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm D-Rod with another figure review for you guys. This is Ace Ventura Pet Detective by NECA. Now, <laughs> I got this figure because it looked dope, it looked cool, and it's Ace Ventura. It's one of my favorite movies and I had to have it. Although when I saw the pictures, I saw the uh, head sculpts, didn't quite look like them. Once you get it and you have it in person, it definitely, definitely does not look like them. Uh, happy Friday. Hope you guys are doing great and staying safe. WandaVision came out today. I saw it last night at midnight. But anyways, before we get started in this video, please give this video a big thumbs up. Hit that little subscribe button if you are new here. And after you've done that, hit that little bell so you get notified when I upload my videos and we need to get to a thousand subscribers in order to do this other big giveaway keep sharing this channel to your friends to your family to you you know if you can on some facebook pages anywhere you can i want to keep giving away stuff to you guys so anyways let's get started with this ace ventura pet detective shady acres this is from the scene from ace ventura when he goes investigate psychiatric place to find out about ray finkel because Ray Finkel was there after uh, their Super Bowl loss and he's trying to investigate what happened or where he or where is he at uh, this is one of my favorite scenes from the movie Jim Carrey is phenomenal in all the movies he's done anyway so I like this scene where he does the whole super slow mo thing and I love the figures outfit the uh, everything's detailed but the face sculpts guys the face sculpts oh my god anyway so this figure comes with of course uh the figure it comes with the dog it says ace ventura pet detective i think this is the most accurate thing besides the clothing uh, of this thing i love this uh, even though it's just cardboard but i like it like i said it comes with a different head scope look at that it doesn't look... from a certain angle if you put him like this this angle it does look like him when you put him straight up <laughs> it doesn't look like him it has some similarities see the side nothing have to do with jim carrey put him a little bit like this you you could see a little bit of jim carrey there and course he ha has a dog i like having the dog here but i just don't like it it's empty from the bottom uh, don't get me wrong guys i love neca figures they're like very detailed very awesome and ha they have great accessories but this these head scopes really did not do it for me if you're an ace ventura fan you'll probably end up getting it but if you are a jim carrey fan you probably won't get it look at that the detail on the face scope is it's crazy look at those eyes the pupils the eyebrows very well detailed Here, let me get closer on it love the hair though the hair is is there the white devil hair <laughs> so when i was looking through the figure uh this is the funny thing i was undressing him why would i undress the doll All right so look he has little uh marks there and dude is buff but once you get it open here <laughs> it's like two different pieces of of a uh, figure this does not match this at all two different parts it's horrible it's like this dude has a six i never ever saw him having a six pack being muscular because check out his biceps the dude is muscular this is you doing the accuracy but i hate that his torso his chest part is way different than than his abs so you can see the color on it stands out a lot and you can see that on his hands too this is more pinkish than this this is more i don't know say tan and this is more pinkish maybe through the video you can't see it but in person you can the clothing phenomenal i love the clothing i love his fucking ballerina dress here when he has it and his classy damn short pants uh, that he carries oh and his boots his boots are awesome now before we keep going with this figure check out this thing they fucking oh my god this is horrible look at that pink from the bottom they didn't paint it right check it see the the peg down there is still pink right like i said i love NECA but this figure oh my god it's so check it out guys so his head moves all the way around cool you can move it this way that way <laughs> and of course he has his movements i don't know why NECA figures i i know that you could fucking blow dry it or use hot water but you know it's people who just like to get them for the first time they don't expect all these stiffness around uh, so you do have that shoulder movement your the, the hand was is able to go all the way back but because of the shirt uh it has restriction you can move it uh, but he has good movement he has a double jointed elbow he has wrist hand see and of course his abs 
Oh my god, that looks even terrible right there. Very, very bad. So he could move. Here, let me put his shirt back on. There you go. So he could move forward that much and then back that much. Cool. And then his head could look down that much and up that much. Not a lot of movement. Oh, he doesn't have a waist movement. It's just his torso. See? So it moves from there. There's no thigh movement on this figure, so it's it's all from the leg from the top. But he's very, very flexible. Check it out. Very, very flexible. Awesome. And then he has a single joint to knee. Again, his knee, it can only go up that much from there. Of course, you know, he doesn't need to be kicking all the way up. But that, he could kick that way. Oh, his leg comes down. What the hell? That shit got loose. See this one. This one's not loose. This one is loose. Wow. Okay. So then you have his ankle movement. He could go up and down that man that much so you know he does have the ballerina pose no, no, no. and he has a ballerina the ballerina dress his boots are actually awesome with his socks pretty awesome but check it out you can already see the pink there that's horrible that's nasty i'm probably gonna have to paint over it this figure man i mean the detail is awesome you just needed to get that shit right and see here this is this uh different head scope where he does his little mouth movement. This is why I wanted to do the the football stance from this scene because this is where he does this uh, facial expression. And yeah, but I couldn't get it. So from the back, you can see it. Pretty awesome. The front, the front kind of throws me off because it's it's not like that, you know. What do you guys think? Tell me in the comments below what do you guys think of this figure. Look at that. The detail on it. It's it's good. Oh my god, his his eye looks horrible. <laughs> Like I said, the detail in it's great. It's just not Jim Carrey's face. That's the bad thing about it. His eye is kind of crooked too. Now that I can see it, oh, his left, his right eye, which is this one, um, is kind of a little bit more to the right. It's not proportion right. Check it out. So, and this is the other head sculpt. See, the the similarity is almost there, but it's it's not Jim Carrey. It's not. My wife actually made a good point is that you are able to see um, his cheekbones, you know, because Jim Carrey was always skinny. His cheekbones were his main thing from his face and he has no cheek. He has chubby cheeks here. So we need that cheekbones to come out. And here's the dog again. Like I said, it sucks that it's flat from the bottom. I wish he would have had his little legs, but I get it. They're trying to do the scene where he's laying down and at least Put the magazine on it you know so it could be good and we could get that when he solves that ray finko is eye horn so i would have liked to have the magazine under the dog or something and then like i said the ace ventura pet detective uh card pretty awesome to serve and protect your pets and then the back is just a piece of cardboard i am gonna keep this i think this is like the best thing of it <laughs> in my opinion I'm gonna be honest with you guys. If you guys were to ask me and you're in a budget and you're like, would you recommend this? I would say no. If I were to give this figure a rating, I don't know, man. I don't wanna be too harsh and I don't wanna be too soft. <laughs> um, so I'll say four out of 10 for this figure. It's a NECA figure, it's it's great detail, but it's just not the face coat as uh, Ace Ventura fan and Jim Carrey fan it's not something I would recommend to someone else buy if you get this as a gift fine keep it but don't buy it in my opinion don't buy it now I'm gonna be straight honest with you don't buy it I hope you guys are liking my videos please 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 comment below what do you guys think of this figure what do you want me to do next thank you guys so much for watching this video see you guys on my next video peace